Hello, grade 11s. Sometimes it is necessary to convert metric quantities from one unit to another. To do conversions, it's essential to know how units of measurement work. Metric units are the units of measurement used in South Africa. The metric system consists of three basic units. These are meter, gram, and liter. Meter can be used to measure distance, area, and volume. For distance, we use kilometer, meter, centimeter, and millimeter. For area, we use kilometers squared, meters squared, centimeters squared, and millimeters squared. When something is squared, it means to the power of two. The units for area are squared because of the formula we use when we calculate area. This formula is area is equal to length times breadth. Both length and breadth should be in the same unit. This means that when they are multiplied by each other, the unit for area is squared. To calculate the area of a rectangle with length equal to 4 meters and breadth equal to 5 meters, we will use substitution into the formula. Length will be replaced by 4 meters and breadth by 5 meters. 4 times 5 is equal to 20 and meters times meters is equal to meters squared. The fact that the units for area are all squared is really important when we are doing conversions. For volume, we use kilometers cubed, meters cubed, centimeters cubed, and millimeters cubed. When something is cubed, it means to the power of three. The units for area are cubed because of the formula we use when we calculate volume. Volume is equal to length times breadth, times height. This means that we multiply three measurements that have the same unit. To calculate the volume of a rectangle with length equal to 6 meters, breadth equal to 3 meters, and height equal to 4 meters, we will substitute into the formula. Length will be replaced by 6 meters, breadth by 3 meters, and height by 4 meters. 6 times 3 times 4 is equal to 72 and meters times meters times meters is equal to meters cubed. The fact that the units for volume are all cubed is vital when we do conversions. We also have to know the conversion factors for converting from one metric unit to another. A conversion factor is the value that you use when you convert from one system of units to another. Conversions are between units of the same measurement type, such as volume or area. Let's look at kilometers. The name gives it away. Kilo means a thousand, so a kilometer is a thousand meters. Centi means a hundredth, so we need 100 centimeters for one meter. Milli means a thousandth. This means that we will need 1,000 millimeters for one meter. Lastly, for the meter family, there are 10 millimeters in a centimeter. If you ever forget this one, just look on your ruler. It is marked in millimeters and centimeters, and you will be able to see that 10 millimeters is equal to one centimeter. Now that you know the main units of measurement, it will be easy to do conversions from one to the other if you follow the rules. Look out for the next videos on conversions. Remember to try the task video at the end of this section. You'll be able to learn more about measurement on our website www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. Thank you for joining us Grade 11s.